Without exaggeration, Ivana and I rushed to Romania just to be here for the 100 year anniversary. Yes, of course. So if you cheer for Dynamic, <laughs> or if you cheer for FCBS, <laughs> the name speaks for itself, okay? BS, okay? <laughs> Rapid number one, okay? <laughs> for three weeks, okay? Right. They're going out of their mind three weeks before the season starts. Yes. But hey, it's 100th birthday, so it's a special day for rapping. 100th year of rapping. Woohoo! May you live to be a thousand years. A hundred more years, rapid. hundred more years. Okay? <laughs> Are we okay? Hey, hey, don't, guys, don't forget. See this guy? Is it a thumbs up? See the guy with the thumbs up? That's the same guy from Cluj. The same Rapid fan. The first day in Romania on Romania 2.0. And now on Romania 3.0, that's him again. Same guy. Rapid fan, the best. Yeah, look at him, he's just stunned. He's just hitting him with his hands. I drive a truck, I drive a truck, I drive a truck. That's the guy. Oh, what a superstar. What a stud. Thanks. Oh. Yeah, he was the first guy who made me feel at home. Like we are in Romania. The second time we were in Romania. Yeah. Yeah. He's like, hey, Romania. He made us feel at home. I'm like, oh, we're back home. He made Romania feel like home. Yes. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You won't believe it. You won't believe it, okay? Whole street food festival for the 100th anniversary. <laughs> I can't find any meat. Oh, God. If there's meat here, it must be hidden in the corner. <laughs> the pizza looks very good. Yes. Uh, they, got a, they got a proper wood burning wood stove. Open, yeah. But I mean, there's no beach. Get some yeah. beach, please. Hello. <laughs> Still a rapid though. We're just outside of the stadium. Beautiful, beautiful anniversary here. Yes. But, uh, Good a celebrate. couple pieces of meat, please. <laughs> Salute. What an absolutely awesome party we had yesterday. It was an absolute blast. And I want to give a huge thank you to everybody who came and met us and interacted with us on the live stream because Ivana and I were live for something like three hours in the pouring rain and the conversation was really enjoyable because so many of you guys came up and said hi we took a bunch of selfies and we even scored like three or four free drinks. So we knew Rapid fans were the best in terms of uh, fan support for football, but it turns out they're also the best in uh, fan support for partying, Ooh, yes. which is a uh, nice experience for us. But the only problem with yesterday was we did not find any meat. <laughs> so we are minutes away from Obor Market, which evidently has the best meat in Romania. So let's eat. Yeah. Line up. A 
so it's you know that it's good <laughs> can smell yeah. Mitch, 10. 10 Mitch. 10 Mitch. 10 Mitch. 3 bread. 3. Okay, we got 10. I love the way I said 10 Mitch and they were like, 10 Mitch. You crazy, man? By the way, look at the whole bucket of mustard over here. This is what I'm talking about, okay? Look at the bucket of mustard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a good amount of mustard. That's a massive beach grill. Thanks, Paul, buddy. Yeah. Hey, introducing or actually reintroducing the greatest food money can buy. And By the way, look at the lake of mustard. <laughs> That's the right amount of mustard for these meats. And special shout out to our friend Paul. Ooh. You guys remember him from last year? Cheers, uh, everybody. Mr. Bucharest himself. <laughs> <laughs> very good meat. Long awaited. Oh, yeah. Oh, very good meat. really good. <clears throat> yeah. Five star meat. That's fair. Six star meat and good bread. <laughs> Taste the, the spot. Especially after a night of drinking. Just right. Nice. Okay, Vana. Let's eat. Let's eat. Let's eat. <laughs> By the way, I never saw that. What's going on with Obor Market? They got ladies' braziers hanging off the off the rafters, man. <laughs> Okay, something new. That's actually, Steve, the best type of kebab is Mitch. Yo, Ivana. I thought it and you said it. Yes. The Ottomans made the food and the Balkans perfected it. That's the Mitch is the best one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it is, right? It is. The flavor explosion and how it goes with the mustard and the bread and then ice cold beer and good friends. This is, this is, this is the best. This is absolutely seven star eating. Absolutely. Seven star food. Norok. Norok, Norok. And now we go hunting for some fresh produce. I think Ivana's got an eye on some cherries, but we'll see what she decides on because the fruit looks so fresh, doesn't it? Chiresche is cherries, like traditional cherries. Vishine is sour cherry. Sour cherry is Vishine is sour cherry, sour cherry, which is what makes Vishinyata. Same right. word. This is Got the it. one. This is the base for Vishinyata. Uh -huh. right. Got it. So the smaller ones are the sour right. cherries, and then These the are, big ones are what I'm familiar with. These are sweeter. Yeah. Uh -huh. For eating. Capiche, capiche. Right. And we've also got white cherry. Not so sweet. Same flavor as a regular cherry. Uh, less sweeter, I would say. I would say. All right, so we're gonna put the cherry search on hold because we found some really nice tasting cherries, but they were 20 lei per kilogram, which our local friend, Mr. Bucharest himself, said is a pretty darn expensive price. So this is the beauty of traveling with a local. We'll pause the cherries and we'll go for cheese now. Now, if I remember correctly, the white cheese, Baranza, the yellow cheese, Cascaval. <laughs> Nailed Ranza it. And yeah. Now, which one's better? Which one's more yummy? Be honest. Kashkaval, kashkaval is made all over Europe. Like you, you see there, yeah. the kashkaval. Yeah. You see over there. That's, Yellow cheese. That's not Romanian kashkaval. Uh. It's uh, Dutch, whatever. Uh, when you see this kind of white stuff, it's 100 percent Romanian. That's what we want. The white. Uh, I want the and, white cheese. That's the bronze. It, it's called. Telemer, Telemer, bronze or Telemer is the same. Okay. It's either sheep, why, or vaca, which is uh, vaca is cow. Okay. And then we have capra, which is goat. Goat, sheep, or cow. Uh, right. Which would you recommend? Hey, sheep. Goat is very strong, no? I like the goat because the flavor goat usually with the strong. goat is, is, goat is strong. strong. It's very strong. Yeah. You can taste it. Taste it, Steve. <laughs> 
Ceva să nu fie foarte sărat. You want salty or not salty? Oh, extra salty would be great. Salty and... Thank you, thank you. Asta ce e? This is... Why? Asta e oaie. Why? Salty sheep. Salty sheep cheese. Okay. Could go for a goat. More more flavorful. Capra. Oh my. Not bad though. Let's try the salty goat. Let's try the salty goat. Okay. Ne dați o bucățică de asta, care that's goat. Salty goat. Thank you, thank you. Multi mask. Yeah, this one already looks better. See all the little uh, wrinkles in it? Wrinkles. You know what I mean? The little cracks and the little crevices. I prefer goat, but okay, look. Oh, so good. Good thing by you. Is it melting or what? Is it like no, no, no. Ivana, try this. See if you like it because for me this is this is the best one, Ivana. But it's so powerful. Yeah, that one is good. Okay. Good, right? Good or great? It's good. Oh, it's so good, cheese. I can still taste it. I can still taste it. My mouth is so good. Uh, thank you. What's the mask? Salty goat cheese. My favorite. Thanks, bro. What goes better with cheese than olives? These are the ones we saw in Turkey where they were uh, dyed in beet juice, I believe, to make them turn red like that. I think that's the same one. Which one would you like, Steve? Good question. Oh, this is Greece. Greek olive or Turkish? Turkish. I say we go, I say we go Turkish, Joanna. I would go black. But which one? With more, like this kind of one, with the shiny, with the oil. This one. Thank you. Oh. Good? Okay. Not salty. Very salty, but very good. Oh, he likes the salty one. <laughs> okay. 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 Up to you. <laughs> yeah. No such thing as too salty. When you get my age, you will... <laughs> when I turn his age, I'll, I'll hit. The salt is not good yeah, for true, the true, true. Okay. Yeah. For now, more salt, more better. Yeah, please. Eight late for, for 300 grams. It's a big bag That's of olives. Yeah. Thank you. What's your mask? All right, cheese and olives down. Maybe we'll jump back downstairs for our veggies, especially cherries, yeah. fruits and veg downstairs. Really? really? Yeah. So it's not good. Really? That's true. That's what they say. That the nippled ones are treated with fertilizer, so are chemically treated. So like this is an okay yeah, tomato. Ah. The but the one with the nipple are the say, GMO yeah, pesticide something. Yeah, they put fertilizers and all kind of. So you don't want a tomato with nipples? Okay, now we know. <laughs> the world's ugliest tomatoes. Probably no. the best ones actually. Yes, I think this is the best. Probably the most time. natural. Yes, I think so. So you've got perfect is medium, with nipple is worse, and ugly is best. Yes. Now we know. That's a tomato <laughs> breakdown. For eating? You can try one. Half a kilo. Please. Juma? Half. Juma. Juma. Seven Chapter Chapter Seven Chapter Four to be in it. Ultimate. All right, there you have it, everybody. If you guys remember from last year, the second half of this vlog is almost the exact same as a vlog we made last year, but this is our life in Romania. Right. We party hard, we buy some good goat cheese, salty especially, buy some good veggies, and we eat meat. Yeah, I love this kind of market. The prices are much better than the supermarket and also the products are much more fresh. More fresh <laughs> and a better deal. Incredible value and big shout out to Mr. Bucharest himself. Uh, very social guy named Paul. Later guys. <laughs>